Hello, this is Charlie from Henry Herbert Taylors. This is just a short video to help you understand what makes a good suit. And as always, the devil is in the detail. I am going to give you five tips for the jacket and five tips for the trousers. Things to look out for and to ask your tailor. So let's start with five tips for the jacket. Number one, the fabric. Always ask where the fabric has come from and avoid any man-made fibres. You will only be shortchanging yourself with cheaper fabric. The suit won't last as long and it will eventually begin to shine. Number two, the canvas. Better suits are always canvassed. This is something to ask the tailor before he starts work on your suit. Check with him, is the suit canvassed? On the fitting stage, or what we sometimes call the based fitting, always have a peek inside the suit. It should reveal something looking like a canvas. And if you can't see it, the suit probably won't be canvassed. Number three, always ensure the working parts of the suit are, well, working. The pockets, the cuffs, the breast pocket, they should all be working parts of the suit. As a tip, a good tailor will always go that little bit further, making a working breast pocket containing a pocket handkerchief, preferably in a colour that matches the suit lining. Number four, the style. It is your suit, and to make it truly bespoke, you should be able to ask for any style, any pattern, and any feature you wish, no matter how extraordinary it might seem to other people. Number five, the service. The service you should receive should be as good as the suit that is being made for you. The tailor and his firm should go out of his way to make sure the suit and the service are as convenient as possible for you. Okay, so let's look at five things you should look out for for a great pair of bespoke trousers. Number one, glue. Make sure no glue has been used in the construction of the trousers. If you are unsure, just ask, or you can even check yourself. Just peek under the hem of the trousers. This is always a revealing part. If they are stitched, that's great. But if you can't see any stitching, they've probably been glued, and that's not a good start. Number two, always make sure the style of the trousers complement the style of the suit. Slim fit jacket should mean slim fitting trousers. Mixing and matching the styles is not complementary to you and may mean the trousers have been made somewhere different from the jacket. Number three, always make sure the trousers are made with enough spare fabric. You and your figuration will change over the years, so you need to make sure the trousers can accommodate this. All good tailoring houses should build an extra three inch allowance to allow for changes in your figuration. Number four, test the zip. Run it up and down a few times. A cheaper zip will fail quickly. A well-constructed zip will stand the test of time. Number five, make sure your name and the tailor's name and date have been written on the inside of the trousers. You will know exactly then who has made your trousers. I hope this helps. Thank you for listening.